Hey there, Broniacs. Welcome back to Bronze Over Brains. I'm your man, Bronson Layton, of course, and do you guys notice anything different? Well, in the last video, Savannah put makeup all over my face, and I gotta say, up until that moment, I've never seen what my face looked like feminized until then. But if you wanna check out that video, it's right before this one. It's called Girlfriend Does My Makeup. This week, Broniacs, I'm gonna keep things simple, and next week we're gonna come back with our creative, not to mention funny, content. But in the meantime, you can get to know me better. In the past, we've had requests about what my favorite songs are, and we're gonna be covering a few other topics about my personal interests. So I hope that you guys enjoy it. And so, let's get to it. To begin, I'm gonna list my top three favorite songs. My top favorite song would have to be We Are The Champions by Queen. And the reason I like that one is because it details overcoming obstacles to a point where you reach victory at the end of a series of obstacles. And overcoming obstacles is actually the backbone of why I was inspired to create this channel. And my second top song is Thriller by Michael Jackson. Who doesn't like that song, right? Because it makes us uh, look forward to Halloween. And Halloween is a time where we all feel exhilarated and dress up and just look forward to the thrills of the holiday. And I like the sense of adventure it brings both in his famous music video as well as its upbeat tempo. And my third top song of all time would have to be Body Like a Back Road by Sam Hunt. And Broniacs, the reason I like that one is because in the first year of our relationship, Savannah and I have enhanced our relationship through listening to this song because I don't know, it's just got a great vibe to it. it it's kind of romantic to us, or at least she thinks it's funny when I sing along to it. And we even went to Sam Hunt's concert at her school when he came around. And it's just a great memory for both of us. The next category we're gonna go into is my top three films of all time. My number one top favorite is a bit of a tricky one, but I'm gonna have to go with part one of the Sam Raimi Spider-Man trilogy. I grew up watching that film over and over again since I was like five years old. And I don't know, that's how I started loving superheroes. My second top film of all time is... Friday the 13th. Ooh. And the reason I like this movie is because it has an originality to <laughs> telling scary films from behind the background of a mystery, I guess. Uh, I don't know. Honestly, at this point, this rubber stretching my face and I got to get it off. So, <clears throat> oh. And for my third favorite movie, I'm going to have to go with The Breakfast Club. The story behind that movie about a bunch of high schoolers from different classes kind of reminds me of what it's like to be in high school. And more or less, I was a different person myself from most of the class. So being reminded of being a high schooler is like being reminded about youth. And I like to stay as young as possible. So youth is telling me, don't you forget about me, hint. 
and on another subject, Brawny X, I am notorious for watching a lot of Netflix shows, and I know you are dying to know exactly what I've been watching, so you're about to find out. My top favorite Netflix show, I can't believe I'm talking about this, is Atypical. It is about a boy with autism and he's going through the late stages of adolescence, trying to find himself in his peer group and eventually society. Check out that show. It's called Atypical. Very great show, especially for those on the spectrum. You will find great comedy and heartfelt moments in it. My second top favorite TV show, although it's not really a Netflix original, it's Breaking Bad. I just love the storyline of a man going through a transformative process from a pushover into a mastermind of sorts. Although I don't really condone criminal masterminds, I just love the transformation of the show. And my third top TV show, I'm going to have to say, is Stranger Things. Don't you just love the premise of this group of kids who mature through dangerous circumstances in a small town? I know I do. And for those of you who haven't caught up yet, well, sorry, I'm not giving you spoilers. And for the final category, guys, we're going to move into my three top favorite foods. Savannah thinks it would be a great asset to reveal to you, Brawniacs, that since my top favorite food is cheese, I have to tell you about a small story of when I was young. I told my mother when I was little that I love cheese so much that I wish that the streets of heaven were made of cheese. And if they weren't, I wouldn't be going there. Lord, please forgive me. I did not really mean that. For my second top food of all time, I'm gonna go with anything Chick-fil-A. Anything on their menu, chicken sandwiches, the waffle fries, anything in that variety, it's all delicious. I'm just gonna have to leave it at that point. And my third favorite food in the whole wide world would have to be peanut butter. When I was very little, my dad uh, gave me scoops upon scoops of peanut butter for dessert after most meals, and it kind of grew on me. I mean, I was little, come on. And I'm sure there's a lot of you out there who can't live without peanut butter when it comes to chocolate. That's why the good Lord invented Reese's peanut butter cups. Savannah, let's go get some as we finish this video. No? Oh wait, I have some in the fridge. Well guys, I'm gonna have to close the video here. I hope you enjoyed learning about these in-depth things about me. I'm actually glad that I was able to share some of my personal interests with you. And once again, Ronnie X, I'm sorry we haven't been able to do a creative video this week. But next week, we're going to kick it into high gear, and we're going to find out what we have in store for you. So, at the end of this video, I want you to enjoy some of these bloopers we managed to, in the process of producing this video, which I think you may laugh your heads off to. But until next time, I'm Bronson Layton, and this is me telling you, don't you. Forget to stay brawny. Hey there, brawny act. God. <laughs> this is thriller. This is thriller. This is thriller. Thriller. Are you rolling sick? Hey there, Ronnie Axe. Hey there, Ronnie Axe.
Hello, Bromniacs. What's up, Bromniacs? What's up, Bromniacs? Putting it on the wrong way. Oh. Dang it, I put it on backwards. <laughs> I tried to tell you. Jason, why do you do these things to me? 